a lighter in a cookie jar, candy canes with needles, and a chocolate man with hair inside. In this video, we're going to take a look at the 10 scariest things found in Christmas candies. Number 10. Tootsie Pops If you're looking for the world's number one candy-filled lollipop, then you should pick Tootsie Pops. They're so delicious, and they sell so fast, especially during the Christmas season. So what makes them so special? Well, this lollipop is covered with hard candy coating and has a delicious and chewy Tootsie Roll at the center. That's the secret behind this simple and tasty treat. This lollipop comes in different flavors. You can get orange, strawberry, raspberry, chocolate, cherry, or grape flavor. This is the perfect candy for kids until a weird person decided to change things up. A family in New York fell victim to this Tootsie Pop disaster. After Halloween, the mom decided to check through her daughter's candy treats. And when she opened her Tootsie Pop, she found something strange. She found pieces of glass on one of the Tootsie Pops. Now, why would anyone do that? Imagine if it wasn't found on time. It could have been disastrous. Number 9. Peppermint Candy These peppermint patties are amazing. Well, until they're not. They're like minty candies on the inside and have a chocolate coating on the outside. These peppermint patties are loved by many. What makes it unique is how you first taste chocolate before tasting the mint inside. It's a surprising candy on its own. What could be more surprising? Well, if you find a staple pin in your peppermint patty, will that be considered a surprise? Absolutely. This person found one in his peppermint patty. It's really a staple pin stuck dangerously between the peppermint. That's scary and dangerous. This person was lucky to have discovered it right before chewing it. I mean, he could have choked on that. Number 8. Christmas Tree Cakes When kids bite into a Christmas candy, they only expect to be met with the delicious sensation of the candy. Well, that's not the case for this white Christmas tree cake. They're somewhat like Twinkies. The only difference is the shape. You usually find them around you during the Christmas season. There's usually no cause for alarm when you see these cakes. Not until this experience. One day, a family was enjoying some of these Christmas tree cakes during the holiday season. One of the family members took a big bite and was met with a shocking discovery. They found a toenail in the white Christmas tree cake. Unbelievable! If I was the one, I would have thrown up immediately after. It's disgusting! Just be extra careful on every Christmas candy we take. I'd advise that we open them up completely before having a taste. We don't know what we could find. If you think these were scary, things are about to get scarier. Keep watching to see what's next. Number 7. Eggnog with a Pine Christmas is not Christmas without taking at least one cup of eggnog. Eggnog can be so delicious. You could have gone past your limits before you realize that you're already tipsy, or worse, have peed your pants. Now it's a different experience entirely when you decide to drink plant-based eggnog like this person we're going to talk about. This person was serving this eggnog to his grandpa. He served the first cup and everything seemed fine. He served the second cup and everything was still okay. In fact, he served the whole content of the bottle. But just as he was about to get the last drop of eggnog in the bottle, guess what came out with it? An actual Christmas tree! Well, not the whole tree. For those wondering how a Christmas tree would fit into the bottle, they found a full-on pine leaf branch in their eggnog. How did it get there? And how must the grandpa have felt knowing that he just downed a whole bottle of eggnog laced with pine leaf branches? Come to think of it, it's a plant-based eggnog. Maybe that's what they meant by that? I'd definitely not be taking this. Number 6. Heart-Shaped Chocolate Chocolates are just delicious. I mean, look at this heart-shaped candy. Isn't it beautiful? No doubt about it, you'll definitely feel so loved if someone gives you this candy as a gift, especially during Christmas. It's so beautiful that it's kind of sad that you have to break the perfectly shaped candy apart just so you can eat it. Well, thank goodness this person did. The person decided to break open the candy but found a dirty, used band-aid right in the middle. A band-aid and a chocolate candy. If you're shocked about this, we feel the same way. What are the chances that a band-aid would be found in a chocolate candy on Christmas Day? Did it belong to Santa? Thank goodness this person found it. Maybe the person who made the chocolate was heartbroken and decided to put a band-aid in the chocolate that he made. This person obviously took mending a broken heart too far. This could have also resulted in a lawsuit or worse if it was swallowed. What would you do if someone gave you this kind of chocolate candy? I doubt you'd still want to have it after this story. Number 5. Santa Candy It's almost Christmas and everyone's excited. And that's because Santa Claus is coming to town. And while we await Santa, how about Santa-made chocolates? That'd be lovely, right? Well, I don't think this person found that as delicious as he expected. 
One very important tip we've learned so far is to always open up your candy before you dig in. You don't know what you'll find in it. Just like this man who found underwear in his chocolate Santa. To be more specific, he found a piece of what looks like a granny panty in his chocolate Santa. You can't even start to think about the possibility of that ever happening. I mean, how do you start searching through your chocolate Santa just to check if there are no panties lying around somewhere in the middle? The question remains, who put it there? We all know underwear is not edible, and of course Santa himself wouldn't have approved it, that's for sure. Number 4. Fruit Cake This is also one candy that is loved by many. It's called a fruit cake, and some also call it a pound cake. The story of the fruit cake in question is one like no other. This family brought this fruit cake, but when they opened it up, it looked weird. The cake had a suspicious looking crack right on top of it, so they decided to poke the crack and see what was really inside. Just as they were opening it up, they began to perceive a very offensive smell. It really smelled like some fishy fruit cake. Is there a fish in the cake? Did they mistakenly buy a fish? fruitcake? And when did they even invent that kind of fruitcake flavor? Anyway, after ripping the whole thing apart, they found a rip off top of a tuna can. How do you mix fish and cake together and expect it to be good? Who comes up with these weird ideas? And to make matters worse, it's not even real fish. It's the ripped off top of a tuna can. Absolutely scary. Well, lesson learned. Always check the insides of your fruitcake. Who knows? Maybe you'll find the other parts of the tuna can in one of them. Starting out, things get even scarier. Keep watching until the end. Chocolate ginger bread man. This right here is a chocolate gingerbread man. Doesn't it look cool? I mean, you want to take a bite, right? Well, before we get ahead of ourselves, let's remember that not all things that seem yummy are in fact yummy or safe. It could be hiding something scary. This gingerbread in question contains some questionable materials. Someone opened it up and found some kind of white fluff ball in it. Now, the thing about this fluff ball is that it didn't just look like something from a fabric. No, it looked like something that would have come out of somebody's beard. Santa's beard to be precise. Now, the question is this. Is this fluff ball really from Santa's beard? And why is Santa giving us a piece of himself literally? What are we supposed to do with it? Number 2. Candy Cane Candy canes are easily everyone's favorite and go-to candies for the Christmas season. You can bite, chew, or even suck on them. Candy canes can also be used as treats for any event during the Yuletide season. You can take it practically anywhere. However, next time you get yourself a candy cane, try as much of it as possible to be careful with it. This candy cane in question has a scary undertone to it. A family once found a needle inside one of the candy canes they bought. That's scary! How do you explain this needle that looks like it's going to poke you at any point if you got too close. This is a candy that kids mostly take. If an innocent child had taken it, it could have led to a series of disastrous events. Looks like something a Grinch would have done. What would you do if you found a needle in your candy cane? Well, don't eat it. Number 1. Shortbread Cookies Shortbread cookies are the absolute best. The packaging alone is enough to make you want to down every single bite of it. It's usually packed in this kind of old container that always seems to last longer than the cookie itself. Like most cookies, you really can't see what's inside until you open it up. This means that whatever you meet is yours to keep and yours alone. I'm sure you're already wondering what's inside the container of the cookie. Well, this person opened up their shortbread cookie container and found something they were not looking to find in any cookie container. They found a lighter. Now, I have many questions. Was this a factory error or was it done on purpose? Maybe as a free gift or something. Regardless, that is very dangerous. What if the cookie was given to a child and the child had found the lighter? We know how kids love to play with everything. Trust me, the outcome would have been terrible. Enjoyed the video? Now watch this one.